One common problem that human geographers examine is that of global poverty. In order to decide how to fight poverty, governments and other organisations, such as the UN and MPOs, they need accurate information. Geographers can help collect such information. In this presentation, I will briefly introduce three kinds of data collection methods. These are surveys, interviews and observations. One very important source of data are the regular surveys carried out by local and national governments that ask questions about such things as income and expenses. One example is census data in which everybody in a country is to ask a large number of questions on one day. These are very expensive and usually only take place every 10 years or so. The data that results is called statistical data or statistics and gives us a picture of what is happening at a large scale. A different kind of data is collected through interviews. These can be face to face or on the telephone or even Skype. Researchers try to interview particular kinds of people, such as experts or local people, or people who might be particularly affected by an issue. Interviews can give information about why something is happening and how people feel about it. A third kind of data are visits and observations to areas which are particularly important. In this case, it could be very poor areas which are badly affected by poverty. Observations can tell researchers visual information about the impact of poverty on people's lives. Observations are also often combined with interviews. In conclusion, in order to combat poverty, geographers collect various kinds of information, such as surveys, interviews and observations, and a combination of such data can help provide solutions to people who live in poverty.